Okay, you guys, so for us guys, I'm 64. If I can do this stuff, anybody can do this stuff. So we're gonna do a, a, another a very unusual off the wall thing. Hope it helps you guys. Uh, sometimes I find when I'm close guard on my back, close guard in the bottom, uh, some guys are just too hard to sweep, too hard to submit. So this is a very unusual guard uh, sequence. It's a whole series of moves, and I'll show you a few. Uh, but this one, it's also good in actual self-defense if it's street level and for MMA fighters. So I'm going to go here. Now, he's in close guard. A few things that he doesn't ever want to do. He never wants to have his hands flat on the mat here. If I can get him to put his hands flat there, I come and get Kimoras. Uh, what he doesn't want to do, he doesn't want his elbows higher up from my waist. If that's the case, I'm going to get the arm bar. And he never wants to be in a position where one place where I can have one leg over his shoulder here, one under an arm, and I can start coming and getting triangles. So I'm going to try and look for these things. Let's scoot back a little bit. Now, sometimes I can bring my knees to my chest, force his arm here. In this case, and in a street self-defense, you know, in, in uh, competition jujitsu, this is a good place. Self-defense, I'm in a bad place. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna pull him down, I'm gonna grab this, I'm gonna swim up on this side, where my shoulder is here in his neck, I'm on my elbow, and I'm going to reach behind his head and I'm going to grab the inside of my leg here. I'm going to go back to close guard and keep this tight. I'm taking this shoulder here and really driving his head down. I want to keep him broken. This is the arm I'm looking for. He can't see me. He doesn't know what's going on. I'm going to really try. Keep it here. Now he can't punch me. If he can't see me, he can't punch me. I'm pretty safe. When the time is right, I'm going to take it, hook that arm. Now he's in trouble. Self-defense, boom, I can punch him, elbow him, whatever I want to do. Okay. Now, from here, I've got the easy triangle, get the lock, get the arm over, get the angle, get the triangle. That doesn't work. I can hip up. Get an arm bar. If the arm bar doesn't work, I make a fist, put it under the elbow. Now I got the arm bar. That doesn't work. Get the wrist lock. Get a wrist lock in Americana. Okay. So that's called the rat guard. Let's do it again. For here, he comes there. He comes there. Get it. Okay. So we've got that. You guys, if you've done triangles, it's all the same setup. Another thing that I'll do from here, I'm going to grab the wrist, get the rat guard. Now let's say I can't do anything. He's, he's too much. I can't get anything with this. I'm going to wait for him to posture up on that arm, which he does. I'm going to come up on my elbow. I'm going to keep this pressure on his head. I'm going to reach around, thread it through his arm, grab my hands. I'm keeping a lot of pressure on him going to take my foot off and now I'm going to sweep him from there I'm going to come up and I've got just a wicked neck crank mount hook and okay youth and skill no match for old age and treachery stay very treacherous my friends <laughs>